Hi everyone, it's Robin, and welcome back to another Thrift Store Thursday, my favorite day of the week, because I get to share with you all the fun and exciting things that I find when I'm out thrifting, because you guys know I love to do some thrifting. I mean, I could go thrifting every single day and be a very, very happy girl. <laughs> so this past week, I went to one thrift store, and I hit the mother load when it comes to linens. I found some really cool things that I'm excited to add to my collections, and I also found one piece of... Um, dinnerware. So let's go ahead and jump in today's haul. So the very first thing that I found is something that I can use right away. If you remember or watched my spring home tour, you'll know that I'm using blue and white transferware in my dining room right now on my plate rack. And I don't have enough of it to fill in the whole plate rack. So I've been on the lookout for more of it. And I found a beautiful blue and white transferware bowl. It was $2.99 and it looks like this. It is so gorgeous. I absolutely love it. It's got the little house and like the little um, field. What else does it have? Oh, it's got a little stream too. There's a stream. I'm sorry, the glare is kind of bad. And it's got a little bridge. The pattern isn't an exact match for the ones that I already have, but the color is the same and I think it's going to go absolutely wonderful. Um, so I'm super excited about this. Um, it is made in England. It's called Brook Blue and it's made by Queens since 1795. It's dishwasher and microwave safe, so I think this is a newer item. It's definitely not vintage, but it is absolutely gorgeous, and I am so excited to have found it. All right, so there may be a lot of noise in the background. We have got a busy, busy day ahead of us. My daughter right now is cleaning her room, which hasn't been done in a really long time. There's a lot of racket coming from that. I don't know what exactly she's doing in there, but there's a lot of racket, but I need to get this video done. So I'm just going to continue on. Hopefully it's not too distracting. So I went through the whole store and I didn't find a whole lot. I was starting to get a little disappointed, but then at the very end, I always go to the back corner of the store and that is where the linen section is. And it was like heaven, absolute heaven. I kept finding item after item after item of things that I loved. So let's get started. I'm going to jump right in. I found a set of pillowcases. These were $1.49 and there's two of them in this lovely pattern right here. It's on a white background with some little flowers with blue and green and I just think it's so pretty. I know that I have a sheet already, a, a top sheet I think, in the same pattern. So I was super excited to find two matching pillowcases for that. I thought that was pretty awesome. So I kept looking through the pillowcases and I found another one. These are $1.49 as well and there are two of them. And this is a pink and white little uh, plaid, I guess you'd call it. Isn't it pretty? I love this. Um, it doesn't, I was hoping that it was going to have like the um, pink border on it, but it doesn't. But it's all right. I think this is absolutely gorgeous. I think I'm going to use these out on my porch for the summer because I like to use pink accents out on my porch. So I'm loving that. I think that one is gorgeous. And then I found another set of pillowcases for $1.49. And these ones I almost didn't get, but you know what? They kind of... I put them in my cart and they kind of grew on me as they were in the cart. And it is a lovely yellow version. It looks like this. I thought the flowers were really pretty. I wasn't too crazy about the orange, but I did like the flowers. And from a distance, there isn't a whole lot of orange. These would be a nice little like late summer, early fall sort of transition pillowcase, if you will. For, you know, going into the fall, I think that would be really, really pretty to use. So, I'm excited about that. So, those are, the, so I found three sets, you guys. Six pillowcases. I think that is so awesome. I love pillowcases. Vintage pillowcases are my favorite. Alright, so this next item I thought was so adorable that I just couldn't pass it up. Even though I have no idea how I'm going to use it. It was just too cute. I just had to pick it up. It is a children's sleeping bag and it looks like this the pattern is upside down but it's got the little area on the top that flips over and then you got the zipper down the side and it is so cute look at that i mean look at that so adorable so i don't know how what i'm gonna do with it but 
I just thought it was so cute. And I'm hoping that maybe the babies will like it. The one idea I did have for the sleep and make is probably what I will do with it because I think it's a cute idea. But to find a piece of foam or a pillow that would fit in there that I could turn it into a dog bed. I think that would be so fun. So that's probably what I'll end up doing with it. So anyways, all right, so then moving on, I did find a few sheets. The first sheet I found was $2.99 and this is a fitted sheet and, and it's in a twin size, which is what I'm always looking for these days. And I just think it is absolutely beautiful. I love the greens, the pink, the blue, the little bit of yellow in it. I just thought it was a really pretty pattern and it was perfect so I can use it on my own bed. <laughs> so I think that is awesome. And then I was looking a little further and there is the matching flat sheet. But look at this, you guys. This looks like it has never been used compared to this. You see how much more faded the twin or the fitted sheet is? So I am I'm, I'm just loving this. Look how beautiful these colors are. I cannot wait. This I'm going to most likely turn into a blanket because I love this pattern so much. So I will probably make myself a summer quilt out of this so that I can use it on my bed because <laughs> I love it so much. And that was $2.99 as well. All right, so then I found one other set, one other sheet, and this is a twin size as well. It's a flat sheet, but the pattern was so adorable. It was $2.99. And it looks like this. Isn't this cute? I don't know how vintage this is. I think it's a little bit older. Actually, it probably is vintage. Let's see. Here's the tag. Oop. There's the tag. So, yeah. So, I'm super excited about this. I absolutely love this pattern. I think it is really pretty. Um, so, yeah. That's really cute. All right. So anyways, I thought this was really pretty, so I had to get it up. The prices on the sheets lately have been amazing. For a while there, they went really high up. Like they were asking like $5 for a twin sheet. And I thought that was really high. But now for some reason, the prices have come down, probably because nobody was buying them when they were that high. Um, so I'm loving the new pricing on the sheets. <laughs> so yeah. All right, so then... I'm trying to move along because I know a lot of you aren't really into like linen stuff so much as I am, but I have more to show you. <laughs> um, the next thing I found was a field crest. It's by Field Crest, and it is a set. So there's two of them of washcloths. These are vintage washcloths, and it looks like this. And this cute little minty green color with the cute little flowers on it. And then the opposite side looks like this. So there was two washcloths for $1.49. I thought that was pretty awesome. The next thing I found was a vintage hand towel. This was, let's see, $1.49. And it's got a lovely flower on it. Look at that. that pretty? And then at the bottom, it's got this nice little border on it too. So I thought that was super pretty. I love these, these so much. And then I found another hand towel. This one was $1.49. This one's nice and thick. This one is by Dundee. Um, one side is blue with a white flower on it. And then the other is the white with the blue flower on it. So these go really nicely with those washcloths, I think. All right, so then the next one I have two more to show you, and then I am done for today. So the next one was $1.49. on. this is a larger towel, and it is so pretty. It looks like this. Look at that print, you guys. Wow, so cool. Lots of ferns and flowers, and I feel like this feels almost like it has never been used. I mean, maybe used a little bit, but these colors are so bright on here, and the feel of it is so thick that I don't think these were used very much at all. Um, so that was pretty cool. And then I found another one that matches that pattern. So now I have two of them. Two in this pattern. For $1.49. So I got sheets, towels, and hand towels this week. And one um, decorative item. <laughs> so I thought that was a pretty good thrift haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. I'd love to know which of the items I picked up this week was your favorite or let me know down in the comments what you found this past week when you were out 
thrifting in your neck of the woods. Let me know so we can chat about it. I would love that very, very much. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell, and I'll meet you back here next Thursday for another Thrift Store Thursday. Until then, happy thrifting, and we'll see you very soon in my next video. Bye now.